Hey you guys, welcome back. <laughs> Let's do a uh, two week update on the uh, Alocasia Poly that we did a, a rejuvenation of. Uh, you're seeing this probably a week later or even a couple of days later, but it's been two weeks since I rejuvenated or hacked apart this <laughs> Alocasia Poly. Uh, so if you're doing this at home, don't be worried if yours starts to look like this. Uh, it's it, it is what it is, uh, and uh, the reason is is because uh, there's no roots to support the leaves, and uh, so and also it's been really hot here uh, this past week. Uh, the whole week has been in the 30s Celsius with a humid X into the 40s Celsius, so that's really hot. So um, they they've been getting morning sun. If I was smart, I probably would have put this in the shade, like a complete shade, or I would have put it um, in the house. Uh, during during those days, but I left it outside again getting morning sun um, Probably until around noon it would probably get sun and then uh, and then it would be shady after that But anyway, uh, the leaves are all burned off or all dead as you can see this one still got a bit of green But uh, it's dead for the for the most part But anyway, I want to bring you in closer to see that all hope is not lost it's raining here today and the pot is actually dripping. I just brought it inside, uh, so there's a big mess. The pot is wet. I don't not normally want to have it this wet, uh, so I'm probably going to leave it inside at this point just to let it dry out. And uh, yeah, come on down. We'll look inside this pot and uh, see what's going on. Okay, so since these guys are, are pretty well dead, I'm just going to remove them. They're just... Uh, taking energy... well, they're not taking energy. They're just looking unsightly, so let's... Uh, just remove those. So now the pot is a little bit cleaner. Uh, as you can see, we've got a new uh, leaf developing here. We have a new leaf developing here. We got one here. We've got a nice one growing right here. Uh, things are really starting to to really uh, do well, other than the fact that we lost some leaves. There's nothing to worry about. Things will will uh, uh, come back to life. And yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to. Uh, keep it this moist. You really want to have it uh, dry out, uh, maybe the top couple of inches of, uh, of the soil dry out before you water it again, uh, but this is just a little excessive. Uh, it's been like this probably all week um, because of the heat we've been trying to water some things so this just kept getting watered. So anyway, uh, what not to do, but things aren't dying. Uh, things are looking okay, so if you've done this rejuvenation project, just just know that, uh, just be patient, and uh, even though the leaves might die, uh, the, the old leaves might die, uh, the new leaves will soon be coming. So anyway, uh, if you've started this project, I'd love to see photos, um, post them to Plants and Things What's Growing page. I want to see what happens to yours. It doesn't have to be necessarily the alocasia poly, it could be any type of alocasia. Uh, so I'd love to see what you're, what you're working on, your projects. So anyway, uh... Again, until next time, you guys, happy growing.